This video is to show you how to upload your index page that you have modified with this link and your exercise 2 to my drive. Again, you need both of these files uploaded. Okay, you're going to be uploading your index page every time because every time we do an exercise, you're going to create new links. So I'm going to go ahead and upload both of these files. So what I'm going to do in Dreamweaver, again, make sure that your USB is in the computer before you start this. Once you've got Dreamweaver open and these two files completed, you want to go under the window menu and open up the file panel. Okay, when the final panel opens up, you want to make sure that you have expanded it like I am. Again, if you go to the edge, you can go ahead and make it wider. I'm going to go ahead and close my property panel because it's in the way. You want to go to this last icon and split this window into two sections. On the right here, this section shows all the local files or what's on my USB. I need to flip this little triangle, sideways triangle down so I see all my files. Here's my index page and here's exercise two. I need to connect to my drive. I'm going to go up to the top here and I'm going to go ahead and click on this icon to connect to my drive. Okay, I can see that I am connected because I see this little teeny golden check mark. I can see my public folder but I need to see also Art116. So I'm going to go ahead and flip this open. Here's Art116, okay, and I want to make sure that my exercise2.html and index page are in or uploaded to art116. Okay, I'm looking here. I have more files than you're going to have at this point because um, I've taught this class before. All right, to upload these, I'm going to select exercise2. Okay, it's selected. I'm going to go ahead and hold my mouse down and I'm going to drag it to the left side and I'm going to place this file on top of Art116 and let go. This window is going to open up. You can go ahead and just say yes. Should dependent files be transferred? Yes. In this case, what Dreamweaver is going to do is take the images of the button, the banner, the cropped image, and it's going to place those in my image folder for me. I also want to upload my index page. So I'm going to go ahead and drag and drop it on top of Art116 because I want to overwrite the old index page that doesn't have the link. I'm going to go ahead and let go of my mouse. When this opens up, again, I'm just going to say yes. Now what you're going to want to do after you upload them up, upload both of these files, you're going to want to open up your student URL in a browser and you want to make sure that you see your index page with your link, your newly created link, click on that link and make sure it's correctly linked to exercise two. If you did everything like I showed you, um, everything should be fine, but make sure that you're checking. All right, that's it for this exercise.